Welcome back, my philosophers. Well, sunny and childlike for the Sagittarians. That's because the moon is in Aries, a fire sign just like you, but it's also focusing your emotions and your heart, really, on your soul expression, on romance, on creativity. This is the part of Sag that really is fun to be around when this part of your soul is lit up like a Christmas tree, if you will. There may be one little hesitation, though, I just want to point out, even though your heart, I think, will be childlike and full of a lot of fire and charisma, it's actually opposite Venus in Libra in the house of friends and society. That means you might find yourself in just a little bit of a tug of war between some sort of friend or situation with friends that your heart really loves and what your heart really needs to do for itself and its own self-expression or romance. This can also play out, I find, in times where you literally have a conflict between your heart and a romance and your buddies that want to go out and have a few beers, that sort of thing as well. Just realize it's a subtle tug of war and if you get caught in it, just dismiss it. It's only going to last for a day and the universe is just highlighting parts of these two areas of your life. Not a big transit. Now Mars has recently moved retrograde. Because of my absence, I couldn't report on it, but Mars now is moving backwards in the sky. That means it's time to redo an area of our life. And if you're a Sagittarian, that is around intimacy. I would not be too surprised in the next couple to three, to three weeks that you don't find yourself redoing something that involves your boundaries. For instance, having to reinforce them with a certain person, maybe in a certain sexual love affair, it gets rekindled again for a moment. Oh, another lesson. Now you're involved again intimately with someone that you thought maybe you would not be. Or this may be you going down another rethinking of someone who has died or someone's passed on where you have to reprocess, remourn. Maybe you discover something. It's not a bad thing. It's just the universe is making sure we are very thorough in a Taurus way and Mars makes sure that we have to redo something. So don't get pissy when something has to be redone. But good news, tomorrow is your birthday Sagittarius. Today we were at 29 degrees Scorpio. So this is the last degree of Scorpio. The sun will be coming out from your subconscious and into the day and that's going to be a great Thanksgiving for you. All right, so we'll have more tomorrow on our Thanksgiving special. And until then, Sag, live, love, be. So God.